So mimi mtu mwenye sikizangi radio very often but one day around 8 years ago I was walking by I think one of my family members alikuwa ameasha radio then as I was walking by ilikuwa very early I think ilikuwa show ya Jalango na Mwakide they used to do a show in the morning so nikasikia this new artist alikuwa naimba then he introduced himself as Otile Brown and the song was called imaginary love so i just listened to him then kumsikia mara ya kwanza i just knew i had a hunch this guy will become a star so a few years later akaendelea kutoa songs from time to time akatoa alivyompenda by king kaka which in my opinion was his first hit wimbo wenye lisikizo na everybody then after that akakuja akaanza ku date na vera After that akatoa baby love he became an even bigger star. Then after that there were rumors they were le- it was later confirmed akatoka his label Dreamland Music aka jajiri mwenyewe people thought his career would stagnate but aka reinvent akaanza kutoa hit after hit. Then I think that was the time when he met the current manager So I'll come to a Noria guy if I'm not mistaken. Then after that I ca open a music label Just in Love Music. Wakaanza kutoa song after song na kumbuka they even signed two artists Jovial na Lex if I'm not wrong though the venture was not as successful but they tried. So recently i just learned that otile brown and the manager have parted ways and normally kitu kama hii kifanyika there are three three options either kutakuwa na a positive effect which means that maybe manager ndo alikuwa na drug behind so wakiachana he even does better than he's doing now then option number two is the the manager leaving has no effect so ata kama manager amenda he continues at the same level that he is now then the third effect which i think most of his fans wata wata nini wata dread ni manager amwache then level yende chini but we can only hope that that will not be the case so what do you think will be the case let me know in the comment section